pandemic has affected the way many people do many different things. And this is especially true for some churches and how they collect tithes. KCAU 9 News reporter Lydia Vasquez explains how some Siouxland churches have adapted new strategies to stay afloat. When this uh, COVID first hit, I, I said to the Lord, Lord Jesus, I totally, I'm, I'm really worried here. Please do not let me be disconnected from my congregation. Father David Heeman is the pastor of Holy Cross Parish. He says a few months ago, church donations were up 2% from last year, but he says those donations have since gone down. This is where faith comes in. You don't like to see the drop, but your faith says, hey, I've been doing this 35 years and I've always seen it. We've always managed the people of God always come forward. Susan O'Brien is the director of stewardship and development for the Diocese of Sioux City. She says the development team along with senior staff and the bishop decided they had to get creative at keeping contributions flowing. We created an online offertory page so that people could go online and make a gift and during that time that they were suspended but then as time went on we really pushed our parishes to also create an online giving page if they did not have one and educate their parishioners about online giving, recurring gifts, and that has really helped. O'Brien says since the pandemic began, many parishioners have made larger donations than normal. The, the thing that didn't happen is we didn't dive and crumble and, dis, and, and dissolve into nothingness. I mean, the people did come forward. In Sioux City, Lydia Vasquez, KCAU 9 News.